Good day. My name is Lisiba Maledi and welcome to First Cut Films, your Red Gorilla Filmmaking Forum. Ever asked yourself how much muscle it takes to make a film? No, no, not that kind of muscle, but brains, you know, the number of people it will take to make a film production possible. Oh, you're just curious, how many departments need to be involved towards making a film production? Well, on today's video, we'll be discussing who does what, when, in what department, and what their roles and responsibilities are on a film production. So in all production departments, everyone has a role to play and something to contribute and we all share a common goal which is making the project a success. Making a film is like painting a picture with an army. That's not me guys, that's Austin Wells. Dang it. I should have said it's me. So right now I'm just going to break it down as to who's at the top of the pyramid down to who's at the bottom in the line of command or the food chain. And who does what, when, in what department do they belong in and what are their roles and responsibilities. Yeah. Depending on the type or scale of production, there are about 16 departments or more involved towards making a film production. Well, this can vary between if you are making a B-movie, a feature film, an animation, or a short film. So the list of departments involved towards making a film production a success are as follow. You have your key creative team, you have your production department, you have your script department, you have your location department, sound department, camera department, your unit department, you have grip department and you have your art department you have electric department and makeup department you have your wardrobe department you have your post-production department you have your visual effects department post-production music or sound department and you have your craft and catering service department under every department you'll then get your crew who's assigned to different roles and have different responsibilities to carry out and to contribute towards the film. Creative team consists of the producer, director and scriptwriter. We can say this is the brain of the production. In the production department, you'll then find your executive producer, line producer, production manager, production coordinator, production assistant, production secretary, first, second, third assistant directors, and let's not forget the production accountant. And in your script department, you'll then find your script editor, script supervisor, and script coordinator. Locations, location manager, location scout, and location assistant. What's to follow is their responsibilities. Right now, we're just starting with their roles and in what department do they belong in. Camera department, the eyes. So in the camera department, that's where you find the DOP, aka the director of photography. Then you have your camera operator, and then you'd have your first assistant camera, who is the focus puller. Then you'd have your second assistant camera, who is the clapper loader. Then you'd have the loader. Don't confuse the two. The clapper loader and the loader. Those are two different things. And might sound a bit weird and confusing, but you'll have your digital imaging technician, the camera production assistant, the data wrangler, and the steady cam operator. Oh yeah, and not forgetting the motion controller. In the sound department, that's where you'll find the production sound mixer, aka the recordist, and the boom operator, aka the boom swinger. Someone who just, you know, hold that boom until for like an hour. Just sorry about the way my video looks, just, just changed like that. I know it's a bit dim now and totally different from what it was looking when the video started, but I make use of natural light and when it's not there, I have to make use of lights and they're not strong enough and this happens you know because sometimes i have to shoot these videos after coming back from work and all of that so you know we have to do what needs to be done to make these videos for you guys so apologies for that but i hope this you can work with this with that said without wasting any of your precious time let's move on to hair and makeup you know in that department the key role players are the hairdresser and the makeup artist so in the grip department that's where you'll find the key grip best boy and the dolly grip it sounds small but it sounds small but it's a big department moving on to electrical department the electrical department is so important because without them we wouldn't be able to use the equipment on set or even make coffee you know, so it consists or it's made up of the gaffer, lighting technician and the best boy. Of course, someone needs to make sure the whole look of the film is inclined with what's in the script. So that's why we have the art department to make sure they bring that to life. 
The art department is made up of the production designer, set designer, art director, illustrator, set decorator, buyer, props master, props builder, greens man, key sink, and armor, the guy who deals with uh, the guns, you know. The visual effects department are also responsible in making the film look so super dope, dope, dope. That department is made up of the visual effects supervisor, composer, met artist, and paint artist. My real tip for you today is to approach your work with respect and bring positive vibes on set and to those production meetings. You know, be a problem solver instead of just bringing problems or have options, you know, other than just having all these problems that no one can solve or that you have to deal with. Be a problem solver, don't just bring problems to the table and be a team player. That's my real tip for you today. Well, this is not the end of it. There's a part two video to follow. Please subscribe and thank you for watching First Cut Films, the real gorilla filmmaking forum.